Oh, hell nah. What's going on guys? Back at it, but this time with a brand new series. Granted, I am a little bit late to the party when it comes to this game, but nonetheless, here I am. And I'm not too late, so bear with me. Uh, you guys probably already know about this game. This is obviously, you know, Man of Medan, as you see here on the screen. I actually played a little bit on movie mode uh, with somebody, and I didn't get very far, so uh, I only got to the part where you basically just meet all the characters. And that's about it. So I am still very fresh when it comes to this game. So with that being said, let's go ahead and just jump into this game. I do gotta say, the graphics look on point uh, at the beginning and stuff. And I say the beginning only because I've pretty much only been to the beginning. <laughs> I don't know what this guy's problem is. This guy's so weird. That song reminds me of Fallout. Hardcore. We're at the Chinese marketplace with these two drunkies. <laughs> All righty, Buster. We better mosey on back to the ship. Yeah, let's go, Buster. Whoa. Stop the presses. What? Looks like old Charlie Charming's got a little business to attend to. <laughs> Can I fight? Give me a quarter. Why? I'm gonna find out my future. Let's have it. What's in store for me, Pop? Have you got a question to ask? Uh, uh, let's go ahead with tell uh, me about I my guess son. I just want to know about my son. Will he, uh, is he gonna grow up all right? Things gonna work out for him? Okay, so I'm gonna be 100% honest, dude. There's no way... Well, normally there's no way I wouldn't go with the dragon, so I'm just gonna go ahead and be different and go with the bamboo tile. Press, okay, right trigger. I'm playing with an Xbox controller, but I'm on the PC. It, it's a fish. Looks like a fish. Whatever that means. Oh, that's nice. Death. Wait, what? What does that mean? Hey, what does that mean? <laughs> it means what you're gonna hell, die, man? dude. <laughs> Let's see what my traits are. Uh, insecure, reckless, guarded, selfish, altruistic, and eager. I don't even know what altruistic means, to be honest. Hey, bud. Let me get a go at it. Oh yeah? Think you got the stuff? Oh, I got the stuff. Fight? Sure. Let me another quarter. Gonna start a tab. I'll give it a whirl. I'll give it a whirl. Alrighty, let's see if I remember how to do all this stuff. Alrighty. That's it. Oh, got, gotty. Woo! Let 
That's all you got, stick man. What are you talking about, man? I'm doing great. Oh, that was close. It's getting tougher. Oh, no! I missed. I guess the machine got the better of me. Hey, Chuck, we better get back to the ship. We don't want to get stranded. Come no, on, we don't. Let me ask another question. We really need to get back. Uh, okay, eager, selfish, show reckless, and secure case. Nothing changed. It said it updated, but nothing's changed. That doesn't look nice. Nothing like a US serial number. On what's supposed to be caskets. But they have skulls. The skull and bones on them. Gee, I wonder what's gonna happen. This dude's literally making a big deal out of 50 cents. Over 50 cents. I just want to emphasize that. I don't know what 50 cents is when you adjust it for inflation, but uh, according to the time, but I uh, still don't think it's that much. That can't be good. Why are they holding up a picture of my son? Whoa. I think this dude was having a nightmare. See, this is the picture they were holding up. Right here. No, turn around. There you go. The controls are weird in this game. So that's my son. Uh, to Pops, come back soon. Yeah, I don't know about all that. Not that I don't want to. But it's more like I just won't make it. <laughs> Yeah, I found the 50 cents. Now that other dude can be quiet. Alrighty. Let's go ahead and get out of here.
I would be so creeped out, dude, if this was me in real life. Literally be pissing myself, dude. Howdy, Charlie. How's your time off? Just get me out of here already. <laughs> what the hell's going on up there? Got your 50 cents, bro. And gunfire. Me too. And there was a, a corpse. What? In the sick bay. Something's wrong. Let's get out of here. Get out of my way, Charlie. Woo! Oh, someone's just getting blasted, dude. Keep calm. Watch me screw this up. This dude's face is disgusting. <laughs> I don't like that dude's face. Oh, it's starting to get faster. Alrighty, well, let's go find out what, what happened to the dude. What the hell? Holy crap, dude. You know, I've already played this part. Uh, like I said, I did the whole uh, multiplayer thing. And that still scared the hell out of me. Ah, I guess I can't go that way. Come on, Charlie. Follow me. I'm the leader in this situation, not you. And I'm not paying you back, yo, 50 cents. So I really don't want to do that whole tapping thing. So that was weird. I already have it on the settings where instead of tapping to complete those, you know, quick time events, you just hold it, but for some reason it still made me tap. God damn. Another stint? Who's the lucky? Oh, damn. Buckley. Last time I saw him in the mess hall, he was fit as a fiddle. Poor fucker. Never knew fiddles to be fit. Uh. Can we just, like, not go downstairs? Can we just go to the deck and then just go somewhere? <laughs> Hijack one of the helicopters? What's over here? Well, nope, this way. Why is everything closed? It's like it's forcing me to only go one place. Fine, I suppose I'll do what you want me to do, game. So, uh, is it just me? Or are you getting a real strange feeling right now? Do I look like a guy who likes to talk about his feelings? <laughs> yep. You look like a mess on wheels, Chuck. I ain't the only one. Great. Good company. Oh my god, dude. That still scared the hell out of me. You see that kid over there? Uh... No? You feeling alright? Ugh. 
I don't like horror games. They're just sleeping. Taking a quick nap. I feel bad for Charlie, man. All he's got is a knife. Dun, dun, dun. Here we go, boss fight. <laughs> hey, come here. Wait, wait, I just realized that that's Charlie. Oh god, no. Charlie! Oh, dude, and I just realized this, but that's my son. Oh, hell nah. He's, I don't want to, oh, crap. That little bastard stabbed me. Dude, he's got four arms. It's the guy that punched me. Damn, dude. So when it comes to that part with my son, I was observing and I totally forgot I was supposed to react. <laughs> so I didn't actually get to do anything. Either way, I died. Dude, some of these images are really disturbing.
The song is pretty legit, man. You know, if I was able to monetize my content, I would probably cut out that part only because of the music, or at least mute it out. But I'm not monetized right now, so I'll just leave it in. Hello, and welcome to my repository. Thank you. It's a pleasure to be here. So kind. Don't burn in your hair now. I am the curator. The curator of stories. Oh, okay, nice stories to meet you. Stories of love and hate, greed and beauty. Very nice. And death. Stories such as this one. Oh, okay. I'm here to record the story you choose to tell. You see, this tale is only part written, and the choices you make will complete it and determine whether the lives of those with whom you are interfering continue to flourish or whether they are snuffed out. You see, we each make decisions according to our own moral compass. Oh, okay. And we have to live with those decisions or die by them. But you shouldn't fear death. It is, after all, inevitable. I agree. It is the tax one pays for having lived, and it comes eventually to everybody still none of us want for it to come too soon do we oh, of course as in life the actions you take matter the choices you make will affect others i'll be keeping a close eye on your progress it's not my place to interfere but i might be persuaded to offer the occasional hint here's one for free Oh, okay. There are pictures in this world that can show you some possible futures. If you can find them and study them, they may just help you to make better decisions. Or should I say, decisions that result in the outcomes you would prefer. That's all for the moment. We'll talk again soon enough. We'll have the opportunity to account for all the actions that you've taken. Whatever mess you've made. Alrighty then. So I stopped playing right after this little intro part right here where you meet the characters. I only did a quick, like, 20-30 minutes of gameplay, doing the whole movie night thing, just to, just to basically get the feel of the game. So this is Brad, witty, he's Alex's brother, and he's innocent. And he's also got beer. Motivated, his name is Alex, he's Brad's brother, Julia's boyfriend, and he's very insecure. Or, just, it just says insecure, but... I'm going to throw in the very if we run out, for no we reason. <laughs> so, uh, look. I've never been down there before. Down? The water? Diving? Me either. Maybe you could show me how the pros do it. Are you serious? Uh, yeah. I mean, are you serious you came out here without taking any lessons? Uh, kind of, yeah. Uh, it's embarrassing. Uh, you know, I gotta make a living, bro. I wanted to. I just didn't I didn't have time, you know? I had to work all summer. Oh, uh, fair enough, fair enough. <laughs> Whoa, careful. That dive cam is, like, super expensive. Look, bro, be cool. What? Julia and Conrad are, you know, how do I say it? Super fucking loaded? So? They don't sweat the little stuff, man. It's not cool. Don't make me regret letting so you So they're rich off. kids. Uh... I was invited, dude. Chill out. Uh, tag along? Seriously? I thought I was invited. Julia wanted you to come along. <laughs> For real? 
Julia? Yeah, man. She wanted you to come. And I wanted her to see how cool you are, which you're not. So be cool. Damn, dude, chill, bro. Like. <laughs> All right, amigo. Calvary's almost here. Cool. Sorry I'm a little snappy. I'm just... The new medical school would be stressful, you know? Total shocker. And man, the long distance thing with Julia, it's been rough. Uh, it's been two weeks. <laughs> nah, it must be tough. Yeah, I got you. It must be tough. No worries, man. Huh? <laughs> yep. Right on cue. What? Conrad doesn't think we have enough beer. Ah, I guess I keep these in an undisclosed location. Yeah. Let's check out their relationship. All right, so... Envious, witty, eager, truthful, anxious, innocent. And, uh, well, so far I've got a pretty good relationship with Alex, of course. He's my brother. Hey. So, uh, can I get your input on something? Nope. Yeah, what? It's just, uh, kind of a big thing I'm trying to make a decision about. About finishing med school? No, but it's just kind of a big life choice, you know? Don't, don't tell know, me he's trying to ask to whatever his girlfriend's name. Uh, Just go with your gut, dude. Go with your gut. If it's right, you'll know. Really quick. Brad told Alex to follow his gut. <laughs> okay, congratulations. Pro proposal. Yeah, he's about to ask what's her name. To get married. Excited. Julia, Conrad's sister. Alex's girlfriend. She's reckless. Okay. Foolhearted. Conrad, Julia's brother, and he's relaxed. Oh, sorry. Connie, this is Alex. Hey, what's up, man? Conrad. What's up, bro? <laughs> Watch it, sis. Lady killer. Right here. <laughs> Good to finally meet you, Conrad. I think he's trying to steal Brad, me from way, his sister. Bro. Hey. Bradley! I feel like I already know you. I've heard so much about you. Yeah, uh, likewise. Miss me. Hey, man. Want to crack a colon with me? Every second. Huh. Uh, that's a lot of seconds, cowboy. I mean, I would have... This should be interesting. <laughs> uh... Yeah, cool. Yeah, yeah cool. <laughs> Tight. Uh, Tight? <laughs> Check out their relationship. All right, they're all right, I guess. Hold on, let me let me see if I could put on some subtitles on here. All right. <laughs> right on, Bradical. I like the cut of your ship. Bradical. <laughs> it's Jip. Don't ruin it. You ever do any diving before? Nope. Nah, I'm not gonna lie to this dude. Um. No, actually. Never done it before. Water virgin. Nice. Hey, we're gonna pop your cherry together. <laughs> uh, dude's got jokes. <laughs> Where's the old crust bucket skipper anyhow? Impatient, Fliss, captain of the Duke of Milan, courageous. I'd invite you to make yourselves at home, but, uh... Already. So is everybody on board and ready to go? Why ask if you don't even care? Uh, to know an answer. You're selling, I'm fired. She made me waste my beer! Maybe I should. Little boy. <laughs> what about over here? That's pretty far out of the way. 
I'm just thinking about backup targets in case we don't find anything on the dive cam. Listen, to be honest, I've never heard of this wreck you're looking for. Usually these things are crawling with divers. Yeah. This one's different. I'm just saying, if it gets too late, I know some nice places where you can just take, you know, a nice dive. Uh... You know what? Brad did his homework. Brad did I his homework. believe in him. If he says the wreck's here, it's here. Okay, look, you're the client. I'm just saying we don't have unlimited daylight. I'm gonna go help Conrad and Julia with the camera. Definitely gonna get my brothers back. What you got? Feast your eyes on this. It's an airplane. Brad's calculations were right on the money. Always bet on Brad. Yeah, the kid's a whiz. We should thank him. Bliss, we found a plane. Yeah? Yeah, it looks like World War II. We are ready to dive. Uh, technically, we should call this in to port authorities as an unreported wreck. Well, technically. <laughs> She's got are really you nice sure eyes. want to do this the right way? They both do, actually. Uh, we can't dive? Wait. Are you saying we shouldn't dive? The right way. Come on, what is this, kindergarten? I had to bring it up. If we just go down and take a look, who's gonna know? Fine. As long as you're quick. And don't touch anything. She sounds disappointed. I just can't wait to be the first one down there. Can you imagine? Untouched? Yeah, that would be a pretty cool experience. We should be ready to get you guys in the water in a few. I'll set up the tanks. The boys will do the final checks. Take a look at the camera. See if you can find anything useful. Right -o. Hey, awesome. maybe you should check on your bro. Yeah, he's pretty drunk. Oh, I'm stuck. There we go. Man, the controls are so weird, dude. <laughs> Wait, is this one of the pick? Huh. It is. What am I looking at here? How is that supposed to let me know what the future holds? That's so broad. Broski, you aight? What's up? How you doing? Sorry, that Broski got the better of me. Uh, don't worry about it. Hey, all part of the adventure. Sorry for putting a damper on things. No worries, dude. Took more than that just to script the trip. Just get some rest. Come back when you're feeling better. I'm trying to be a good older brother. What's this? Locked. What's over here? I'm not sure Julia left anything on the mainland. Some nice it's perfume. Only as good as it costs. At least it made her happy. Let me see. What is this? Shroud of Innocence. I would probably read this. And it looks like an actual, like a, like a book from a title that out, like, like a real, I guess. Is that everything? I want to explore a little. Doesn't look like there's anything else. Already looked at that. All right, let's go back upstairs. Let's check this out. Oh. It's her ID. This doesn't look kosher. Driving instructor. Authorized to conduct, okay. Why doesn't it look real? It just looks old. What do I know? I'm not a diving instructor. What's this? <laughs> Stupid. Do you know how to use that? Uh, no. Not really. You might want to just let it do its thing. Don't tell me how to live my life. You, talk to me, woman. Hey, hey. Wanted to find out about that shady-looking ID of yours. 
There's a little gap in the tail. Take a look. There's a little gap in the tail? Sure, why not? Let's take a look. Wait. I don't know. I, I honestly don't know what I'm looking at right now. Oh, there. That's the tail. Okay, got it. That's a freaking cool looking plane, dude. Not even gonna lie. Alright, that's everything, looks like. Anything else to explore? What's this? Some nice little binoculars. Any fishes? Hey guys, tanks are ready. Any tanks aliens? No? Alrighty. Let's go talk to Julia. My girlfriend. Turn around. Okay, so <laughs> this is the rebreather. Way cooler than a regular scuba setup. Calm it down, takes rich all that girl. CO2 that you normally just exhale into the water, and instead it gets totally reused. Then it reduces decompression time on your way up. State of the art. Okay. O2 check done. Whoa, 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 eager beaver. You gotta check your O2 first. Eager beaver? <laughs> Uh, let's play around. Looking good, Jay. I'd like to take you underwater. Oh, hey, I didn't mean fl I thought that's my sis you're talking about. I didn't you think it was it? gonna be flirting. <laughs> okay, you little clown fishes. I'm gonna go see what Fliss is up to. I think I offended hey, Conrad. I really didn't mean it to be flirtatious. For a first mate. Uh, let's take let's take the stick. Got the bank stick. Oh, I heard that about you. Ha ha. <laughs> nope. Just remember the rules. Let's talk please. to Julia. Uh. Uh, let's be a little romantic. Maybe we can fire it up again tonight for our private post dive special. <laughs> Are you gonna bring your bang stick? <laughs> Oh. <laughs> that's gonna pop <laughs> oh, that's funny. Let's go. Is it just us two going? Nobody else is getting ready, so I think it's just us two. Found our first shark. She been flissing so tight. She acts like we're going to ransack the plane. Hey, a souvenir would be cool. We should it's just get like it and fly away. No thing would hurt anybody. I won't tell if you won't. <laughs> not like we can scan the wreck every night at sundown. How yeah. would you know that? That chief. That's gotta be it. Whoa, that is like way bigger than I thought. It's pretty intact, too. This is a fucking remarkable find. Let's swim around a little and find a way in. All right. Hey, Captain. Howdy. You fancy a pint with your second in command? You are not my second in command. <laughs> no, fresh in your cabin, boy. Still a no. Your well paying, dashingly handsome, seafaring client. Requesting the pleasure of your company over a frosty amber liquid. Oh, he's smooth. Uh, uh, she needs to focus, man. We've got Cass, people downstairs. I have to stay focused on your friends down there. Sorry, bro. Pretty nice ride you got here. Where'd you get the cash? Um, it's a long story. It's a long story. It's complicated and it's really difficult to explain. Well, I'm a complicated guy. 
Try me. Well, it involves at least several trips to the bank and signing of big stacks of paper with large numbers on them. So you took out a loan. You know, you're smarter than you look. If you're interested, maybe my family can make an investment in your business. He's trying to win her over with money. Um, I'm not going to be prideful, so that's very kind of that's you. That's very kind of you to offer. I suppose we could have that conversation. Uh, you know what? I better spend some time keeping the Duke of Milan ship shape. Aye, aye. Aye, aye, Captain. Alrighty. Weather looks clear. So, par partially cloudy, I think it said. Don't you worry about my ID now. Oh, it is. She. I think it is fake, dude. Look at her acting all shady. That's weird. I wonder if I can open that door that's locked down here. I think it was this one. Oh, I can. Oh, it's another picture. Well, uh, around. okay then. They're very broad. But it looks like some sort of pirates or something. Is she going to look through her stuff? Let's see what she says about this. Nothing. She's nosy. Look at her. Looking through other people's stuff. All just because she's a captain. Nah, I don't think there's nothing else in here. Oh, wait. There's uh, something right here. Alright, so... I'm not going to read this only because I'm terrible at reading, but I'll go down it and you guys can just pause it. Call bank, cancel. Okay. I probably should read because it's probably going to give me clues on the future. Let's see. Oh, wait. There's something down here. Who am I calling? Duke to Alex. Duke oh, to okay. Julia? The divers. <laughs> oh, they're dead already. Game over, guys. Let's see if there's any aliens. Whoa, dude, it's starting to get foggy, or am I tripping? Doesn't look like there's any aliens. Alrighty. Here, talk to me. Uh, nope, 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 yep. Hey there, how's it hanging? Short, shriveled, and to the left, as somebody once said in a movie from a long time ago. Uh, take advantage of your relaxation time? You look like you're taking full advantage of your relaxation time. I'm a man of many talents. Too bad charm isn't one. <laughs> it's too bad charm is not among them. Ah, but my charm is like a boomerang. You think it's gone right over your head until smack. You're out cold. That makes no sense. <laughs> uh. All right, let's let's uh let's make it romantic. I think there's I supposed to, to be something the there. Drive, but I'd be happy to continue this conversation later when I can give you my full attention. In private? Private. Just Whoa. just chatting it up you and I in the old conversational intercourse. <laughs> <laughs> 
I wasn't expecting it to get sexual. Weather looks clear. No. Okay, so what am I supposed to do here? Let's look at this over here. I think it's the last thing I need to see. Wow, that is not your everyday wreck. I hope those clowns don't get me in trouble. Look at how fast I can skip through this. I legit have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing here. Oh, there we go. Oh, it's the picture. What's that about? The dude with the gun. Uh, fishing boat? Fishing boat, from the looks of it. How should we handle this? Uh, you know what? This feels. Only off. because of the picture. Just be quiet and don't say anything stupid, okay? Oh shit. We got divers down in the water. Guys, you gotta keep back. We've got divers in the water. Damage here, you see this? Look at our boat. We can take care of this man, it's not a problem. What do you think? Like uh ten bucks cover it? Wow. Oh, whoops, my bad. Let's make it twenty. Well shoot, you you think it's more like thirty? I can do thirty. Alright, you guys drive a hard bargain, but I'm with you. Here, let's just throw in the whole pot. Wow. Well, uh, that doesn't look like it's going to end well. said one of the pictures showed an opening. Conrad, really? <laughs> the rear turret. Huh. Good on you, Connie. The turret. We can get in through there. Cool. Let's see how this uh turns out. Oh. oh, careful. Could be dangerous. My finger was already uh, on X first? button. Thankfully, because uh that was scary. Can I just take a second to say holy shit, Alex, we did it. Oh, what's I mean, this? Can you believe it? It's a dream come true. Oh. Let's not wait for the Is she having a heart attack? I think she just had a heart attack. What's this? Julia, leave it. You'd have to take your gear off to get in there. Not worth it. That pipe's pretty tight. What if you get stuck without your rebreather? Man, yeah, I don't... That's not a good idea. Yeah, no, nah, hell no. Nah. Maybe it is kind of dangerous. There's a difference between re being reckless and stupid, and that's... Well, I mean, I guess reckless and stupid is... <laughs> two ends of the same stick, I guess. Is that a... Is that a bullet? It is. Bullet holes. All down the fuselage. Brad's gonna flip when he sees this. Damn. What else is height? What is this? Check it out. They reconfigured the bomb raft to hold lifeboats. Interesting. One of the rescue boats is missing. Think they were using it? 
Maybe. Let's see what else we can find. This is kind of creepy, but pretty amazing. Oh. Dead body! Oh I would actually love to dive like this, dude. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, he's handsome. He's holding something. What you got there, homeboy? Looks like there's two girls on it. Wow. What the hell happened here? From the look of things, they knew they were goners. Maybe. Uh, you hear that? Nope. Let's check it out. Did she just drop the stick? This dude has a gun. A 1911 by the looks of it. Holy shit, dude. I think Woo! my wet suit. Life gives you lemons. That scared the hell out of me. Pilot and co pilot. Gotta be. Plane crash not high on my list of ways to perish. Alright, what do we got here? Oh, there's something on the other side. This stuff's been down here a long time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's way too cautious. I don't know about all of this, though. <laughs> oh, Julia! Oh my god! Just don't touch anything else, please! Yeah, let's go. Let's just get out of here, dude, before we end up dying. Alright, yeah. Let, wait, can I come? Over here? Oh wait. No, I think I think we already explored this place, so let's go ahead and get out of here. Maybe we can go upstairs, uh, go back up to the surface. Why is what's his name not coming with us? Did I forget something? I'm pretty sure I ended up uh, forgetting something. No, there's nothing here. Alright, yeah, okay, let's just get out of here. I don't know why he's not following me, though. Weird. Swim away! Swim away! Wait, what is that on the floor? Did I already look at that? Oh yeah, that's the picture. Oh. We gotta get out of here, now! What's this? Dude, you almost got eaten by a reef shark. It's a gray reef shark. Not interested in us. Let's go. I want to know what I just picked up. Uh, oh, okay. Thought this was the right time, but then didn't know if it was the right time. But I guess no time's the right time. I, I, I don't guess. Oh, uh, dude, he's about to pop the question. Oh. After we almost I know died. You can't tell. Because we're underwater, but I'm on my knees right now. Uh huh. Julia, will you marry me? Uh, they seem like they have a nice. Real... Well, I can't even say yes. Let's just say I was... we almost I, died. I... Oh crap. I, Alex, I'm, I'm sorry. I, I mean, I, I just. Oh, I, I think I just said no. Just died. 
Julia, I'm serious. Oh, round two. Yes, let's just do it. Yes. Alex, wow. What a goddamn story. Yeah. <laughs> so, yes, yes, I'll marry the shit out of you. <laughs> Aw. That's cute. All right, handsome hero. You want to get on with our escape from the, uh, crumbling death trap? Nope. Fliss, this is Julia. We're coming back up. Over. Hey, where's that other boat come from? Oh, okay, so both of... This is Wait, right before the boat Julia, came. We gotta decompress here. Whoa! Damn! What the fuck? We gotta get up there. Wait, we have to decompress. What the hell's up with that freaking... Wait! If you don't decompress, dude, you can have a heart attack. Okay, no, yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. Decompress, right. I'm sorry, but I just remembered that picture of her having a heart attack, and I think that's probably why. Uh. Uh. Okay, yeah. Oh my god, this is taking too long. This is torture. Just a few more seconds. Okay, now. Go, go! Hey, what the hell is going on? What the hell happened? It's cool, man. Everything's alright now. What? What was that explosion? Oh, nothing. Your brother just took it upon himself to blow up my grill. Oh. My dad, what is wrong with you? Uh. Why are you paying the ocean? <laughs> well, yeah, what's with that other boat? What was up with that other boat? These fishing guys came by and ran into the dive line. Whatever. Who cares, right? What I want to know is what you guys find. Well, we found the plane. And it is huge. He looks ridiculous. Oh my god, you guys. Can you all just shut up for like one second? Holy shit. Dude, bro, congrats. Nicely done. Come up and let's celebrate. Yeah, let's get let's get chocolate wasted. You're getting to know these intrepid adventurers then. Alex and his little brother Brad, trying to swim with the big fish. Both seem out of their depth. And Julia, the love of Alex's life. And he, the love of hers. What about Conrad? A bold fellow, you might say. Yep, just a little or bit. Maybe you'd say arrogant. That too. And then there's Captain Fliss, strong, Forthright, stubborn. Do I detect a spark between her and Conrad? Maybe. Let me reassure you. You help them to make some decisions they'll value later on. You're doing well. Thank you. All right, guys. I'm actually going to stop it right here. Uh, we're already crossing over that one hour point. So... This is actually very interesting. Dude, I haven't gotten this far at all. So uh, it's actually really cool to me uh, the whole way that all of this plays out and how all of these decisions could affect the ending of the game. So I am actually very excited to continue this game. So with that being said, definitely do me a favor and drop a like on this video and subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed. And while you're at it, definitely hit that notification bell because that's the only way YouTube will notify you every single time I drop a new video here on the channel. So with that being said... Catch you guys on the next video. Deuces.